Born on March 30, 1968, in Charlemagne, Quebec, Canada, singer Celine Dion had recorded nine French albums and won numerous awards by the time she was 18. She recorded her first English-language album, Unison, in 1990. Dion's real breakthrough into pop music stardom came in 1992, when she recorded the theme to Disney's hit animated feature Beauty and the Beast. She went on to record several hits, including Four No. Once, The Power of Love, Because You Loved Me, My Heart Will Go On and I'm Your Angel. Dion received the National Order of Quebec, her province's highest honor, in April 1998. Later that year, she appeared alongside Aretha Franklin, Mariah Carey, Gloria Estefan, and Shania Twain on the high-profile televised concert Divas Live, 1998, on VH1. While touring relentlessly and recording several albums, including S.I.L. Suffiz A.D. A Mayor and a Holiday Album, These Are Special Times, both released in 1998, Dion was well rewarded at the Billboard Music Awards in late 1998, where she won six awards, including for Artist of the Year and Album of the Year, for 1997's Let's Talk About Love. Her extensive 14-country tour, which began in the summer of 1998, culminated in a gala concert in Montreal on December 31, 1999, in honor of the new millennium. Dion scored her fourth no. One hit with I'm Your Angel, a duet with R&B singer R. Kelly featured on These Are Special Times. In the first months of 2000, Dion announced that she was taking time off from her career in order to focus on her family. She and Angelo had been trying to have children for years, and eventually decided to use in vitro fertilization to conceive. In May 2000, Dion underwent two small operations at a fertility clinic in New York in order to improve her chances of becoming pregnant. Her efforts were successful, and on January 25, 2001, Dion gave birth to a boy, Rene Charles. She has revealed in interviews that she had stored another fertilized egg in the fertility clinic and planned someday to give her son a sibling. On October 23, 2010, at age 42, Dion gave birth to twin boys. Angelo, who was diagnosed with skin cancer in 1999, was in remission. After a two-year hiatus, Celine Dion returned in March 2002 with A New Day Has Come, which topped the charts in more than 17 countries. The year later, she began a much-hyped 36-month engagement at Caesars Palace, the famous Las Vegas hotel and casino. Dion simultaneously released the album One Heart, which did not fare as strongly as its predecessor. Dion returned to creating French-language albums with 2003's One Fee and Four Types. Partnering with photographer Anne Geddes, she had a hit with the children's music album Miracle, A Celebration of New Life, 2004. In 2007, Dion released two albums. Taking Chances nearly reached the top of the pop album charts, and DL's was another French-language recording. While she no longer dominates the charts as she once did, Celine Dion remains a popular entertainer. Forbes magazine reported in June 2009 that the singer earned approximately $100 million in 2008, making her the second highest earning musician on the magazine's list, after Madonna. In August 2014, Dion cancelled all of her shows scheduled through March 22, 2015 to focus on her 72-year-old husband, whose throat cancer returned, and her children. I want to devote every ounce of my strength and energy to my husband's yes, healing, and to do so, it is important for me to dedicate this time to him and to our children," the singer said in a statement. The superstar also dealt with her own health issues in 2014, according to a press release. She had inflammation in her throat muscles which prevented her from performing in her Las Vegas show. Dion apologized for inconveniencing her fans and thanked them for their support during her hiatus from performing. In a 2015 interview with USA Today, the singer spoke about her husband's battle with cancer. When you see someone who is fighting so hard, it has a big impact on you, she said. You have two choices. You look at your husband who's very sick and you can't help, and it kills you. Or you look at your husband that's sick and you say, I got you. I got it. I'm here. It's going to be just fine. Dion described her conversations with her husband about his illness.
I'll say, you're scared. I understand. Talk to me about it. And Ren says to me, I want to die in your arms. Okay, fine, I'll be there, you'll die in my arms. On January 14, 2016, Ang Will lost his battle with cancer and passed away at the age of 73 in the family's Las Vegas home. He left behind Dion and their son Rene Charles, age 14, and five-year-old twins Nelson and Eddie, and three adult children Patrick from his first marriage to Denise Duquette and Anne-Marie and Jean-Pierre from his second marriage to Anne Rennie.